I don't know whether it'll fit you or not. That's a mite snug, but I reckon it'll do. You'd think bankers could afford new coats instead of covering them old ones with patches. <laughs> These are the targets we shoot at. Hey, ain't them dandy little dishes. Just right for saucer and coffee. Why in carnation do you want to shoot at a saucer like this? If you ain't careful, you'll bust them. Who bounces the cup? Oh, well, there aren't any cups. You see? You done busted them, didn't you? No, no, Granny, we don't use cups, just these saucers. I mean, these targets. The object of the game is to hit them as they fly through the air. Ah, I reckon I'd like to try that. Give me a gun, Jethro. I'll handle the release switch, Chief. <laughs> All right, if I try it without this little coat. Oh, yes, Mr. Rabbit. But I wouldn't suggest you trying it with the rifle, because when you yell full, those targets are going to shoot out there at 60 miles an hour. Full! Oh. so you could use it again. Well, Jed, from the looks of all them broken dishes out there, you ain't the first one that made a mistake. No, Granny, you don't understand. You see, the object of the game is to break the target. But to do it with a rifle is absolutely remarkable. Oh, shucks, that ain't nothing. A lot easier than shooting flies. <laughs> Can I try? Yes, of course, but I, I think you better use the shotgun. Oh, well, this here is Granny's. This here is the gun I'm used to. Leader of my Jethro. Okay, Uncle Jed. Pull! Be my guest, Mr. Clavett. Well, I'll pick you up about nine in the morning. Fine and dandy. Bye. Bye. Thank 